Hello everyone, I'm still playing catch up on my videos because I was on vacation for two weeks and I fell really behind because I didn't pre-film stuff very well. So, I'm doing my update number eight to project finish 24 in 2024. It's just like it sounds, you try to finish 24 makeup products in the year 2024. So, <laughs> The only problem is, I think I said this last update, I did not do a good job picking these products because I picked a bunch of stuff that was almost finished. Um, so yeah, now I'm nine months in and I have five products left and I finished three. So after this update, I'll have two products left. And the ones I have le left are still things that like, I'm not sure if I'm going to finish um, by the end of the year. So like, I don't know, the next updates will be super boring and it's just not gonna like work. <laughs> so um, I think I have everything pulled out now. Okay. Let's go ahead and get started. Next year, I will do a better job of picking stuff. This is just my first year project planning, so I did a bad job. But anyways, the first thing and the first thing I did finish um, is from Too Faced. This is the Shadow Insurance Eyeshadow Primer. Um, a little bit does come out on the very end. Sorry, my hands are dry. But it's literally completely clear. I just dropped the cap. Yeah, it's completely clear. You can't see it. Um, oh, here it is. Okay. Um, but yeah, it took me a long time to finish, but this month I like actually remembered to use it. So yeah, I don't miss eyeshadow primers at all. I've never really seen a need for it, so I was really just trying to finish it so I could get it out of my collection. Next is one... I finally started focusing on and finished. This is the Ulta Lip Primer. There's actually a little bit left at the top, but I was using this as a chapstick. So what I would do is when I would sit down to do my makeup, I would put this on first as a chapstick. And by the time I was ready to put a lip product on, my lips were nourished and fine. Um, this was also clear. Kind of just felt like a little lip balm. Uh, yeah, I pretty much finished it. It's gone. All the writing on it um, got worn off. But it was the Ulta Lip Enhancer is what it was called. Next is one of the products that I didn't finish. This is from ColourPop. It's the Lippy Pencil in the shade Shot Clock. It is this deep, like, mauve berry color. Here it is right there. Um, yeah, the shade's not as versatile as I thought it would be when I rolled it in. I also rolled in another lip liner that I'm trying to finish that looks almost exactly like this. And I'm trying to finish that one because that one's like this big. So this one's really getting the back burner. And this is the one I was talking about when I was like, I'm not going to finish this anytime soon. Like when I do sharpen it, it like goes the tiniest bit down. So this is still like a lot of product. So I'm not gonna, sure how I'm going to do my updates because I can't just keep updating every month two products that like don't show any progress, you know. But anyways, next is the last product I finished. This is one I kind of knew I'd finish too. This is from Ulta Beauty. It is, it says cream blush, but it was a liquid blush in the shade Sunset. I squeezed everything out of this. I even went like that and would squeeze it on my sponge until it was gone. Um, there is some in the cap, so I can get like a swatch going. This was actually really, really pretty. Like, it was such a good everyday color, but when you blend it out, it just looks so, like, 
not dewy or radiant, but it just looks so good on the skin. It wasn't matte, but it wasn't like shiny at all. It just, it worked really well. And yeah, I, I know I got this a long time ago, so I am glad it's gone because of that. But yeah, did squeeze it all out. And last but not least for this project, of course, I didn't finish this one, but this one is going somewhat fast. This is a single eyeshadow from Revlon, and it's in the matte formula in the shade Peach Sorbet. So that's what mine looks like. I, I'll i put progress pictures on the end of this one, by the way, because there is good progress. You can see all the pan. Um, I've really flattened it out. Maybe not as much as I thought I flattened it out, but yeah, there is a big amount of pan. Um, this is one of those shades that I, I am one person who sets like my eyeshadow before I do it. Here it is right here. So it's pretty much like just a cream color I set my eyeshadow with every day. Super easy to use. Um, but yeah, big pan on that. So... Now that I've finished three of these things, these are the only two that are left for the rest of the year. And I don't think this will even be gone by the rest of the year. This, it definitely will. It won't be gone next month. It might be gone the next. I mean, I use it every day, so I don't know what to do. Maybe I'll just update it when I have progress on this. I don't know but anyways that's my update for this month and hopefully by next month I can figure out how I'm gonna update this but anyways thanks for watching bye